Guys, <laughs> I just noticed that I'm wearing a red shirt and red shorts. It's giving Santa Claus. <laughs> and I have some cookies too. Oh, that noise. Rudolph is just staring at me right now. Rudolph, stop being such a hater. He always wants all the attention with that big red nose. <laughs> so of course, it's a Monday, and that means Crumble just released a brand new lineup of cookies. Now, last week's Crumble cookies were, meh. They were good, but they weren't memorable. Okay, maybe the uh, French silk pie was. That was pretty good. That was actually great. I loved it. But the rest were just forgettable. I, I don't remember what I ate. So I'm hoping that today's lineup slays me. I'm hoping that these cookies are groundbreaking, that they stick with me for life in my mind and in my heart. Well, actually, no, we don't need that in my arteries, like honestly, but I really do hope that they're just amazing. Um, now, the flavors do sound very interesting. This week doesn't have any theme, but the cookies are so different compared to each other. It's almost like they're each their own person, you know? And I love that individuality. I just love that they're all so extremely different. That makes it interesting too. So we have churro. We love the cinnamon moment. Blueberry muffin. Love that. Chocolate cookies and cream. <laughs> yes. And key lime pie. Genuinely? Every single one sounds delicious. I have really high hopes for this box. So I'm super pumped to try them. But first guys, give this video a big thumbs up if you're enjoying it. I try to review Crumble every single week and most of the time I am successful. So give this video a big thumbs up and let me know that you want more. Also subscribe if you love Crumble or if you just love new fast food items. I taste test everything. It's a great time here and I do full menu taste tests. So subscribe. Okay, let's open this box up. I'm ready. Ah, they look gorgeous. Wow. Okay. So we have Miss Blueberry Muffin right here. A lot of crumbs on top. We love that. And then we have the um, chocolate cookies and cream. My mouth just watered. It looks so good. And then we have churro, which honestly has a very strong aroma. I can smell the odors of the cinnamon and we love that. And then we have key lime pie. Looking great. Looking creamy. So everything looks really Everything sounds good. I'm gonna quickly get my thumbnail and then we'll start taste testing all the cookies. The crumbs, it's crumbling, oh God! <laughs> okay. Go eat. Okay, let's feast, I'm hungry. Of course, like always, I'm gonna taste test each of them, give you my honest opinion, rate them from one to 10 and let you know if they're worth trying this week. Okay, let's first try the blueberry muffin. I'm very pumped about this. So we have a lot of little crumbles on top, little streusel moments. Ooh, it's very soft. Let me get my um, cookie cutter. Not sponsored, but I do love this shade of pink. Okay, okay. By the way, who's watching The Last of Us? It's one of the best shows I've ever seen. I've played both games twice, and this show is better than the game so far. And this is not sponsored. I'm just obsessed. Let's get a piece of cookie. Ooh, it's very soft, very crumbly. Wow. There's the inside. Okay. Oh my God. Oh my God. Are you kidding me? I want more. Guys, I'm screaming. Oh my goodness! That might be the best crumble cookie I've had in my life. I'm not joking, guys. I probably had, what, like 100 at this point? <laughs> This is the best one. Okay, so first things first. It is doughy in at the center. So if you don't like that, don't get it. But let me tell you, it works so well with this cookie. The texture is doughy yet crumbly at the same time. Like the edges are more crumbly and then the small center is more doughy. So it's a nice contrast. It isn't too doughy, you know? The blueberries genuinely taste fresh and juicy and chewy. This cookie is perfectly sweet. It has like a muffiny flavor, but just a bit more rich, a bit more cookie-like. 
And who would have thought that a muffin flavor with the richness of a cookie would work so well? It truly does. These little crumbles on top are like hard little sugary shortbread pieces. They add some sweetness. It is just the perfect cookie. I'm so impressed. Like, I could cry. Crumble, you should keep this as a permanent <laughs> item. I'm just saying. I would get it every week. <laughs> I'm not joking. So, I'm giving the blueberry muffin cookie a 10 out of 10. Mm -hmm. Let's try this chocolate cookies and cream. So, it has like Oreo chunks in it and white chocolate chips. Okay. Let's try it. Oh my god! What's happening? Oh my god! Mm. Uh, <laughs> I need to eat the whole thing right now, but I'm not going to. Oh my god. Blueberry Muffin now has some competition. She may not be the best cookie from Crumble. I think there's a tie. <laughs> this cookie isn't really doughy, it's more fudgy. And then the outside is a bit crispy, so amazing texture. Love it so much. Now, it has the flavor of an Oreo cookie, yet once again, more rich. So it has that kind of like dark chocolate cocoa powder flavor, but just the perfect amount. And then the white chocolate chips add a nice burst of sweetness. They kind of act as like the cream. And then the Oreo chunks add a nice little crunch to um, the texture and even more Oreo flavor. And there's a saltiness in there that really balances out those sweet white chocolate chips. It's just perfection. Amazing, groundbreaking. Another 10 out of 10. Oh my goodness, crumble. I swear, if these last two cookies flop, this will be the most disappointing taste test ever just because we have started at such a high, I will legit be upset. So let's hope churro and key lime pie slay me. So 10 out of 10, 10 out of 10, we shall see. Let's do churro. Okay. Very nice, dense looking texture. Let's try it. Mmm. Mmm. So mad, I'm shaking. Okay. Mm. Bellissima! First of all, that cookie is dense and heavy, but in a good way. The cookie itself really tastes like a churro to me. Um, you know how like churros, they're not bland, but like they're like not that sweet. They just kind of taste like fried dough. And this cookie by itself kind of just tastes like fried cinnamony dough, you know? So that's perfect. Then the frosting comes in. First of all, it's very light, very airy, very creamy. So great texture there. And it adds a lot of sweetness, but it balances out the kind of plain cookie so well. It just becomes the perfect amount of sweetness, the perfect balance. The dusting of um, like granulated cinnamon sugar really adds um, to that churro texture. The edges are crispy. Fantastic. Now, is it as incredible as the first two? I don't think so, but still so good. So I'm giving the churro a nine out of 10. We have a 10, a 10, and a nine. Oh my gosh, we have one more to go. Please, slay me. Do not disappoint. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Let's cut the key lime pie. Ooh, this one's very dense, very thick. Okay, that's how it looks inside. Okay. Let's try it. Oh. Mmm. Mmm. 
Oh yeah. Oh, I'm happy. Oh! I want more. One more little bite. Mm. Okay, wow! So this key lime pie cookie is almost perfect. The filling is genuine perfection. It tastes exactly like a key lime pie, but I will say some key lime pies can be too um, citrusy, like too limey, like sour. This one's not, it has the perfect amount of sweetness, perfect amount of tartness, perfect balance. It's extremely creamy, very cold, and I would say that the filling tastes just like a key lime pie, just not as thick. It's just more creamy, you know? Amazing filling. The crust is also great. It has a great flavor. It tastes, honestly, like a graham cracker key lime pie crust. But for me, it's just a little too thick. Um, the texture isn't really crust-like. It is more like a really dense biscuit, and I like that. But um, I think that with this filling, it's just a bit too much crust. So if it was just a little thinner, it would be perfect. I'm gonna give the key lime pie an 8.5 out of 10, which is very strong, very good. So we have a 10, a 10, a nine, and an 8.5. I think because of the first two cookies, this is the best crumble lineup I've ever had. I'm not exaggerating. I think every single cookie is fantastic. Two of them are mind-blowing amazing. And I'm kind of shook as crumble. Crumble. Finally, you committed to me. Thank you. I've been waiting for this moment. I'm worthy. I am. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know in the comments below. Do you plan on trying Crumble's new lineup of cookies? If you do, tell me all your thoughts. And let me know which one you tried and like which one is your favorite. Give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe. I'll see you next video. I love you so much. Oh, oh, oh.